Talia! You know you're not welcome in Gotham. Pack up your league and go. I'm not their commander. They cast me out. Huh. You want me to believe Raish's daughter didn't inherit the job after his death? Because destroying his body isn't suspicious at all. My late father insisted Bruce would be the next head of the League, despite his refusal. Since that ill-fated duel, all the League can agree on is carrying out Raish's mission. If Bruce was Raish's heir, why did Raish kill him? That makes no sense. I agree. It was an irrational whim. I warned him the Batman would be his downfall. But repeated exposure to the Lazarus Pits breaks down a subject's mind. Eventually, their true self is erased. So, instead of giving Raish another chance at resurrection, you stabbed and burned what was left of his body. Consider it a logical choice. A painless end for him, and closure for the League. And for me. <laughs> now they want me dead. Well, we both got what we wanted. You can go now. I have other matters to attend to. The funeral was tasteful. I'm sure Bruce would have appreciated it. Don't. Pull the Widow and Orphan Act with me. You still haven't answered my question. No, but I can ask you one. Why would an apprentice to the cow break into the morgue? I know you weren't following me. It's an ongoing investigation. Ongoing? Left behind by Bruce. I wish you the best of luck. You'll be needing it soon. Because once the League regains its footing, Gotham will be in its sights. So Harley contacted Batman using, I don't know, a homing pigeon and a USB drive? And that's how we got this video? Babs, help. Do we think it's legit? Bruce never talked to me about it. When Bruce worked with criminals, he didn't exactly keep us in the loop. Yeah, it's not you, Tim. But it's also not crazy to think that Harley made this up. Just play it, and we'll know. been out of Gotham ever since, you know, her ex? Killed me? Isn't that what you meant? Rumor has it she did some government thing. Went straight. Ish. She's got something. Then we go find Harley. Now. I was just thinking of that time we all made dinner together, and Tim got tomato sauce all over Bruce and Babs. <laughs> I don't remember that. What? No, you have to. It was the same year. You know what? Never mind. Dumb story anyway. Well, I could tell you a story. It's about being dead, then brought back to life by a pit of mind-altering goo. Hey. I didn't mean that. I don't know what's worse. 
Having a chunk of my life taken away from me, or coming back to everyone thinking I'm gonna snap. I'm sorry, Jason. We shouldn't have... I shouldn't have treated you like an outsider. My god, you're such a boy scout. No wonder you were the first. Deadhood. Looks like you've been eating well. Still big as an ox and twice as mean. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while, Harley. You good? Hmm. Was it too much to ask you to visit earlier? You were looking into something for Batman. What was it? to profile some criminals. On account of my being a brilliant psychiatrist. Guess of all the criminals he knew, you'd be the one to ask. Hey! I am not a criminal! I misunderstood. Look, you know what I'm here for. Hand it over. Everything is in this book. But I'm missing my piece de resistance. I need you to follow up on this here card. That'll make it perfect. Figures you're not making this easy for me. It should be done in records. Okay. Bye.